traders. For today's analysis, I decided to cover Euro versus US dollar. I will speak about uh, gold market, uh, crude oil, and Bitcoin versus US dollar. I will start with the Euro versus US dollar first. So basically, what I found on uh, for our time frame is that. Uh, I found this like in the previous few days that we established the bear flag on the 4 hour time frame and that we also got the breakout of this uh, consolidation and <clears throat> lots of the overlapping candles here. So we got a pin bar but now we are taking that pin bar area here. I will zoom in for you. So we are basically trying to break this pin bar low. I think that will be a very important <clears throat> area so I will mark that for you. So watch this level where we got the spin bar 1.1, 1 .1, 331. If we can clear that low with a good momentum and start to redistri redistribute, then eventually we can retest 1.1, 1 .1, 316, which is the key low from two days ago. Uh, if, we even, if we can even clear that low and with a good momentum, then I can see the price to go all the way down to 1.2, uh, 1 1.1, 286 and 1.1, 1 .1, 275. Uh, from other side, anything meaningful and upside, I would like to see the breakout of the 1.1368 to eventually confirm the price to go back towards the 1.1400 level. Speaking of the gold, basically the analysis that we did uh, um, um, in the in the in the previous days, basically this was ABC. I suggested here that basically the to look for upside opportunities because we were breaking the small contraction and we did have a potential ABC completion of this rally here. Um, so we got this rally, uh, key pivots. I also, you know, mark the area at 1831, 1829. So this area where we <clears throat> did a consolidation for 12 hours and finding the higher low and breaking here at 1816, <clears throat> that was a very good area for the buyers to try this initial move to at least towards the 1830 but what we got actually price went all the way to 1845 which is actually the key pivot levels that we marked so we actually reached <clears throat> first objective based on this upside scenario that we were that we spoke about in previous analysis now <clears throat> we need to watch how the price will react here so far the buyers are still present i don't see any any reversal or anything so if the price decide to still continue and redistribute higher then i can see also Goal to revisit 1865 and even at 1870, 1875. So very good completion of ABC, very good uh, push through the resistance, and um, we are here in this objective. Notice this area of recent swing lows now acting like potential resistance. So we need to see what the price will do here. If we just go for this relatively easily and redistribute higher, uh, watch for even higher prices. Speaking of the crude oil. Uh, from my perspective, crude oil is uh, basically in consolidation. We got this gap down and now its price is at 85.80. Uh, we broke this uh, most recent upside trend line. Doesn't mean spectacular or anything now because we are contracting here. There was a key pivot uh, still around 85.37 and now we are doing this consolidation. In case of the downside breakout of this low at 84.65, I can see the crude oil to go lower to towards 83.50. Um, free level or even 81.35 anything meaningful to the upside in case of the upside break it's a very limited because we have a key pivot height 87.85 in case of something bigger an upside breakout of 87 um, let's say 89 um, we can go to daily and uh, we will find that there is a, some consolidation cluster highs around 84 um, and 80 let's say 85 area and then highs around 107 and 111 so watch for potential and break out this small contraction on the crude oil. In terms of the, speaking of the Bitcoin, Bitcoin is still in the consolidation. We broke this mini contraction here. We're trading higher, probably price can revisit 43,500. Um, because it seems like we're trying to head towards that, that area. Maybe even if we have a power towards the 44,400. But overall, it's hard to say here because we are overall still in consolidation. Uh, let me just go and um, place a profile and uh, you'll basically see that we have this mean here but we also have this contraction so we have we, we were trading a lot 
um, gonna spend basically for many days here about two weeks we're spending here in this area here so we're somewhere in the middle but with an upside breakout of most recent contraction um, that'll be all for this uh, update. I hope that you did enjoy. Um, trade safe as always and see you all tomorrow morning.